In this disturbing video released by Pakistan's army, young children are being taught to be terrorists. The brutal killings they commit in front of the camera are barbaric. But what worries the army most are those being trained to be suicide bombers, increasingly the Taliban's preferred form of attack. The Taliban seem to have so many suicide bombers now, they can use them on relatively low-level targets. Just a few days ago, right here, they attacked a government bus full of workers. And what really worries officials is the suicide bomber was riding a motorbike. And they're worried the younger the attackers get, the easier it is for them to get into the cities undetected. As if somebody's approaching on foot, and uh, there is a possibility that he would bypass security in certain areas. There is a possibility that in the uh, pop population centers, he may not, everybody cannot be checked physically, so he can create havoc there also. In a recent interview with CNN, this Afghan Taliban spokesman boasted three months' supply of suicide bombers, a threat the army here admits may be based on fact. But what they are discovering is it's the Pakistani Taliban at camps like this one inside Pakistan who are producing the young bombers, often selling them on to other Taliban commanders. We have been uh, intercepting messages that the others have been demanding like uh, Fazlullah Group in Swat and Fakir Mohammed and others in other agencies. They have been asking him for the suicide bombers. They wanted to use them at one stage of the battle. According to Pakistan's military, children as young as 11 are being brainwashed into attacks. Both the army here and U.S. defense intelligence experts blame Batullah Massoud, leader of the Pakistani Taliban. He has been admitting that uh, he has, he holds a training center for uh, young boys for uh, preparing them for suicide bombing. So he is on record saying all this, all these, accepting all these uh, crimes. Masood, who never shows his face to the camera, is the country's most wanted man. The army is gambling. They get him and his network. They dry up the supply of suicide bombers. Nick Robertson, CNN, Islamabad. Pakistan.